video, another one, doing it again, <laughs> doing it again, guys, I can't believe we're doing it again, we got another banger for you today, my friends, Silent Face, episode four, part two, I'm snapping too much, goodbye. Here we go. We gotta go save Larry. Or not. There's the dead raccoon still. This is terrifying music. Port Cecil. Larry! Larry! Where the hell are you? There's a note. No. No! Larry! What did you do? Larry, why? Larry's fucking dead. No. Well, he's dead in the present day. Right? That's true, he is. I didn't know he killed himself, though. I don't know. I was so excited to see Sal, I didn't realize how different he was acting at first. When we were hanging out by Windigo Lake, I started to notice it more. At the time, though, he just seemed sad to me. I thought maybe he had stopped taking his medications. Campbell, at this point during your date with Sal, did you ever feel as if you were in danger or threatened at all? No, sir. It was nothing like that. Sal was one of the sweetest boys I, I knew. I always felt safe being around him until later that night. Can you please explain what you witnessed at the treehouse? It wasn't too long after I had gotten home from the lake that Sal called me, maybe about an hour or so. He was clearly shaken up, and I could tell from his voice that he had been crying. He told me that Larry was dead. I begged him to call 911. I told him that if he didn't, then I would. And did either of you call 911? No. The boys had me convinced since high school that there was a conspiracy in Knockville involving the police. They, that they couldn't be trusted. So, I went against my better judgment and didn't make the call. I rode over to the apartments right away. When I got to the treehouse, Sal was acting weird, talking to himself and pacing back and forth. Obviously he was upset, we both were, but I had never seen him like that before. I tried to get him to calm down, but he kept rambling on about cultists and some impending evil. He said Larry was in the treehouse. I took a minute to gather my nerves. I wasn't sure what was going on, if Larry had was really dead or if Sal had lost it. I went up into the treehouse, but there was nothing out of the place in there except for an empty booze bottle. Have you ever known Sal to be a drinker? Not at all. Sal, Sal hardly ever touched the stuff. He once told me that he was afraid to get drunk because addiction runs in his family. And he didn't want to become an alcoholic. So I knew something was really wrong. Larry wasn't anywhere to be seen. And Sal was starting to really worry me. I tried to calm him down and reason with him, but he was not receptive to it. I tried to get him inside, but he wouldn't budge. We got into an argument. It was the only time we had ever argued. I had to walk away from him. I couldn't be around him like that, and I didn't want to make it worse. Before I left, I let Henry and Lisa know that Sally needed help. 
They said they'd look after him, and I told them to call me if they needed me. I felt horrible leaving Sal like that. I just didn't know what to do. I wish I would have stayed there. I should have stayed with him. I sat by my phone all night until I got the second call. This little bitch, mate. Wait, so she's trying to say that he killed him? Yeah. Huh. After ten minutes after Ashley left, Todd showed up. He figured something was wrong since I left so suddenly and he wasn't answering his texts. He drove over in the van with all gear. I told Todd what I told Todd what Larry did. We both needed time to collect ourselves. Larry was our best friend. The fourth the four of us were like family. Like I said earlier. What happened to his body? It's like that, the most that voice for this for this, this dramatic scene, yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure. He really he's trying to tell me something, but it's all broke broken up. I think he's having trouble communicating with us. Uh, let's try out a new gear. Uh, I need to get help. Hold on. With the necrolite modification I made with your guitar, I believe we'll be able to manipulate the spirit well, uh, in some capability. How does it work? Uh, turn on using the G button now. You'll notice that I've added 12 symbols to the neck of your guitar. Play the corresponding notes to activate the symbol. Symbols. Collect the group of notes and then press J, K, or L to uh, strum one of the notes in that group. Try playing all 12 notes. J, K, or L. Wait, G? Oh, then we gotta play this, so... Wait, what? I don't get it. Oh! I get it. to figure out which one. What happened? Todd. Larry. Hello. My dear Sally. Who what? Rose? The life from your guitar contains magic from another world. It seems that the prophecy may have been true after all. Oh, uh, what? What? There is a time to explain. You must use this power to stop them. The devourers of God have persevered despite our best efforts to stop them. What the hell was that? Ripple across the fabric of reality. It has begun. You must destroy the barrier spells to reach the source and put an end to it. How will you do? How will I do that? Use the power of the Necrolites. You will need help from the spirit realm to reveal what is hidden to you. I cannot be of help in this regard, as I must remain within the Black Room. Though I can temporarily release your friend Larry from that which blinds find him, he will be your eyes on the other side. Godspeed, dear Sally. Ciao. Oh. <laughs> He's getting the crap on me. Uh, he disappeared and there was some intense sound that shook the tree house. Uh, where were you? I, uh, I guess the guitar worked. I saw Rosenberg. She said the cult is back. We need to stop them before. Miko and the Niners? The Nico and the Niners. Those, those literally look like the bishops. <laughs> what the hell? How did... Oh my god. Larry! I think Rosenberg is helping us somehow. I was stuck in that damn treehouse so long. It's only been a few hours since you... You you asshole! How could you do this? Why did you leave me? Why? Sorry, dude. I really am. But we don't have much time. 
Rose said the call is here and now has it. We stopped tonight. It's not going to be easy. Well, I can't believe this is real. Why well, can't you re believe you're really gone? Come on, Sal. Let's take these fuckers out once and for all. Not the boy. No. Not the boy. Pilla, this can't be good. What? See if there's anything you can use in your inventory. <laughs> oh, switch to Larry? Larry's note. Oh. Sal, I know this is going to be hard for you to understand. I'm sorry. Please don't blame yourself. And please don't hate me. I was lucky to have you in my life. I couldn't have asked for a better brother than you, dude. I know you're going to be do great things. You've got to keep going. Keep fighting the darkness. It's coming closer now. I can hear it whispering in my head. It's getting louder. I just wish... I just, I just need this to end. I can't take it anymore. I'm not strong like you. I love you, Larry Face. Always. See you on the other side, Larry. Damn. Also, switch. We can switch to the homie. Oh, shit. This is the dead stone. Press R to squeeze it tightly and summon the power from within. You must use this ancient relic to assist Sally. What does it do? What does it say, R? Hello? Yeah. Wait. Wait, I think you do it and then switch to Sally. I guess it, yeah, okay. Wait, oh, and then I think we, now we play... Oh! Okay. Wow, this is, that's cool. Drop down. Oh, shit. Oof. Goo? Venom? Is that blurry face paint? Blurry face? <laughs> <laughs> there was nothing to do on this floor, right? I don't know. It, it kind of makes it sound like you can't come back. Like, why would it ask that? Yeah, we can't go into any of these doors, chat. I wonder if you can switch to Larry on here and see if there's anything different. True. There's Larry. Oh. Oh, okay. We can drop down. This is so interesting. Wait. Okay. Oh, see, big brain on Marilyn. Oh, Larry can go inside. He's taking this man walks in off for chat. Hey, man, sounds good. Okay. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> He's just gone. Wait, so there's nothing over here? R.I.P. Larry. I know. Sad. Gotta check the green goop. Nothing in the green goop. Oh, there's no handle. Okay, maybe... Okay, hold on, wait. Maybe we switch back into Sal. Good call, by the way, on the Larry thing. Okay, then we switch back to Sal. And then we go back and We go in here now. Well, there's a key. Oh. 504 key. Yeah, I was like, there's no way that there's, there's no way, like, if that's it. Like, there's no way that's it on this floor. Like, we, there's more to do. Yeah. 
Yeah, because why would it ask if you're sure you want to leave the floor? You know? Yeah, yeah. 504. Oh, maybe we can meet up with the girl because now we can go to the spirit realm, right? Oh, maybe. Five oh four. I guess not. Those are two eyes, but it's just spots on my fucking thing. Well, there's the noose in here, right? What's this? Oh! Okay, maybe something's there now. Oh. So every time we see something, just press R on it, and we'll see if it works. Okay, so let's switch back to Homeboy. Okay. A little bit more. Ah, ah tape. Oh, she's getting more destroyed, it looks like. Yeah, that, that's what... Yeah, in the Hunger video, she was all cracked and stuff. But now her eyes, I think, are a little different now. It's not here. She's not alive anymore. And we won't be. We're so hungry now. And the skin, this fucking skin, it's so itchy. Why? The skin isn't mine. The skin isn't mine. It's not mine. Hey, I think I do a good job. I should be a voice actor. What do you guys think? I would love to do some voice acting. I've seen a ghost before. I have seen a ghost before. I, I used to live in a house that I swear was haunted, and it was like the weirdest thing I've ever experienced. No, she's a recording to a YouTube video. <laughs> Go to the fourth floor. Whoa. Oh. Oh, oh no. is dad okay? And Lisa, because Lisa's Larry's mom. Yeah. Oh. What are you guys doing? We're watching TV, but what's the point, really? These shows are all the same. Everything has become so predictable. Um, it's just static. Are you two all right? Would you find Sal? Just fine. Everything is peachy. Okay. Yeah, something's fucked up. Yeah, they're they're traumatized. Or the cult's trying to control them or something. Oh, maybe. Leave the TV on. Okay. Leave everything static on. Huh. Okay. We can hear something in the right ear. You hear that? Maybe it's from the. Because of, of the TV, yeah. Okay, let's check everything with Larry, or sorry, with Sal first. Oh. Arr. Everything, let's check everything with Sal, Sal first, and then we'll switch over to Homeboy. Okay, then we gotta drop down. Leave. This is the fifth floor, yep. Okay. Huh. Oh no, he's gonna go s Oh. Oh shit. Yeah, you two okay? What the hell is this? 
Mom? Henry? You can hear me. We're gonna fix this. Just hold on. Oh, they are corrupted by something. Oh. The static. I took away the static with, with Larry. There was something on top of the TV. I don't know what it, I don't know what it was, but it, it got rid of it. Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can go back to Sal. Yeah, if there's anything different. Let's see if mom and dad are okay now. Yeah, they're watching TV. Oh. They're standing in front of the TV, Sal. Now they're actually watching something. Yeah. Okay. So we can save everybody. Whoa. Okay. Sounds good. Can you change the bathroom? Don't think so. All right, let's leave. See you, mom. See you, dad. I wonder if they even know that Larry's dead. Cause didn't it just happen? Yeah. Robert's place. Carry on the Fritz again? Huh? Oh yeah, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, so everybody's fucked up, so we gotta go. We gotta help him. We gotta help him. Crack cocaine man. Yeah, see. Yeah, hey, that's Damn, look at him. Sounds like something happened in the hallway. Okay. So let's go back to him. See, now the music's normal. And we can't even talk to him. Yeah. Huh. Music's normal now. Well, Larry said something happened in the hallway. I think it was the, the pillar, but let's see. plays when you're Larry it's reverse of the song that plays it sounds like it's in reverse oh shoot wait we don't have enough time okay hold on I okay we, we run out of time we have to do it in a lot of time sorry what did you say the song that plays when you're in Larry mode it sounds like it's this song like in reverse yeah, I'm sure it's one of the songs that's in reverse. Or it's that song that, w that was playing. It sounds like reverse. reverse. I think it's cool. I think yeah. it's cool. 403. Is this Charlie? Charlie. Oh, cool. Mr. Sanderson. Well, I guess that's what he meant why, when he said he was living. Leaving. Jesus Christ. Okay, let's let's change into Oh. Man, what the hell happened to you? You look like shit, dude. I couldn't say the same to you. How did- wait a minute, how are you here? Same as you, dead. No, I mean, how are you in this room? The spirits should be confined to their place of death. Sandy should be here, but it's too late. I know it's too late, she's gone. All of the old souls are assimilated. Rosenberg, like, broke the spell that was holding me in the treehouse or something. I'm not really sure. You know what happened to the other ghosts? Does it have to do with the cult? It doesn't matter now. It's, nothing does. I just need to wait here until it takes me. That's the fate we all face in a, eventually. It's not too late. Sal's gonna stop this thing, and I'm gonna help him do it. Your efforts will be wasted. 
it's interesting when like what they show like the people who die in this game in their spirit self are the same look the same when they died so like his head is all blown out you know and there's blood all over him but i think larry died of alcoholism i think so he's just kind of normal just kind of looks like kind of drunk maybe maybe which is interesting yeah that is i guess it seems like that's how he died yeah he like just like poison alcohol poisoning yeah or maybe an overdose yeah. Oh, shit. R. Oh. Oh, looks like another tape. Alright, let's check it out. Uh, yeah, it said there was one bottle up in the treehouse, though. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. Who knows? Maybe, maybe we'll find out. It was it the, the, he there was a, a bottle of liquor in the in the treehouse. That's what the that's what right. Ashley but it was said. just one bottle. Is that enough to kill somebody? Oh yeah, if you drink a whole bottle of alcohol, you can die. Yeah. Oh, I didn't yeah. know. There's, there's a chance you can for sure. Gotcha. And maybe he had been you know doing other stuff too. Yeah. Uh. Evolve. Evolve. Okay. Oh. Oh shit. Three get these ghosts, so full of life, strong, healthy blood, tender meat. Oh, how we crave their flesh, yet they deny us soon. Soon we will be there, and they will have called, and we will have answered that the floor is moist. Is this me? There is nothing left. We have consumed. Sounds like something Flowey the Flower would say, but you don't get that because you haven't played Undertale. <laughs> I know who Flowey is, though. Yeah, she she definitely looks fucked up. Yeah, young young Sally is in the. Uh... Oh, young yeah. lore, lore. All right, I think that's everything on this floor. Cause we we saved. Oh. Oh, it worked. Yes, that's it. Okay. I love Stardew Valley. Sleepy time. It's it's the best. See how it sounds like it's like reverse. Wanna go to bed? See sleepy time. Or ding ding. Our oh, sheet. Wait, oh, I feel this like is the guy with the. With this the... is this is David. Here, let's switch let's switch to him so we can see all the chats. look far beyond the anguish of life and even to the true nature of all things therein lies our salvation all right man whatever you say brother back to lair bear I thought they gave the the mannequin yeah. on his feet. There's gotta be some static to turn on. Oh, oh, right, right, right. Is there anything? We can come back. We can see. Maybe there's something else to do first. I don't know. Okay. We'll come back. DJ's play. There's music song. Oh, friends. Sally Face, it's so good to see you. Hey Sal, what's happening? Greetings, I'm glad to see you. You can like it. 
I can't stay for long. I'm sort of in the middle of something. It's good to see you all, though. Are you feeling all right? We're doing just... Oh, wait. We're, we are just dandy, bud. Everything is peachy. You should stay, Sal. Yes, it would be best for you to stay here. There's no use in fighting it, my friend. Uh, well, we really should be going now. Everything is fine. Don't worry, Sal. You will see. Oh, change it to static. Well, the, the cloud in the picture was moving. All right. Maybe now we can go save David. Be some something we can bring in there that has static. Yeah, something. We find something. Can we fix them? Everything's fine, dude. Where is Sal? You will see. I don't know. Did that work? I don't know. Are they fixed? No, he's still glitching. Not David the Lost Cause, lol? Really? Hmm. Oh. Well, yeah, I guess, I guess he is a Lost Cause then. But why do they still say the same thing, the college kids? Why do they still say the same thing? I feel like, I feel like that should have changed. Chalk, how are you feeling, buddy? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah there's uh, something going around. Uh, well, I think it'll be cleared up soon. You showing? Yeah, just keep an eye on Soda, okay? Oh, no. Your daughter, remember her? She's sitting right next to you. Just missed 420. Weird, man. Wait, they're not even. He's not even like. Uh... Oh shit! The the um, the doll. The doll is there. Oh, yeah. Maybe they're fine. Huh? Maybe they're fine. Well, he didn't seem fine. Can Can you turn static on the TV? Oh, uh, yeah. things, uh, spoken cryptic wisps. Huh. Yeah. I don't understand. Maybe we can help him, I don't know. Maybe he's dead, who knows. Real troll. Maybe it's locked his Larry. Why is the toy there? It's so weird. Yeah, it's not. Is it there in Zelly's vision? No. This room's not even there. Oh, wait. It made a noise. I think we opened it. Hmm. 
made a noise, didn't it? Yeah, I heard something. Is there, is there nothing we can do for Chug or... Or David? Or what about the college kids? They're still being weird. Well... Are they still wrapped up in the thing? Oh, wait. We're not done on this floor, are we? Are we, Sippy Time? I feel like... I mean, we, were, we went to every room, though. I didn't see any. Well... Oh, we can pick up the doll. Oh. Okay, we we can pick up the doll. Uh, okay. I can pick stuff up as as as. Okay, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, I think. I think we should just drop down. Okay, I'm going down. I feel like we missed something, but I don't know. Oh yeah, there's a ghost on the toilet, right? All, all the spirits have, like, passed on. Yeah, I think so. Okay. Well, the music kind of changed perfectly. Yeah. Before the light, there was a darkness and nothing more. They have a record player, but I can't do anything with it. Mm. Well, I flushed the toilet. Maybe now I can do something with Larry in here. Something floating in the toilet, I guess I should, ugh. 201 key. Okay. Is that Charlie's room? I believe so, yeah. Flushing that toilet will have heavy consequences further along. Well, we we'll flush the toilet. Hey man, you gotta flush the toilet, man. Oh wait, that's 201. Okay, this, this is... Wait, whose room is that? No, it won't. Okay. Oh, I guess 201 isn't Charlie's. 201 is, is Packerton. Gotcha. Oh god, this room's gonna be cursed as fuck. Maybe the fridge because the goat was in the fridge. Sometimes I forget that Blake just bullshits a lot. Yeah. Oh, you made this game. Yeah, Blake made this game. What do you mean? Blake, I love you, but you're just you're just annoying sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay, let's let's switch to homeboy. Packing Zoe's place is now open. Pressing F on everything. At this point I'm too tired to deal with you. Yeah, you just have to stop talking. 
to Blake after a while. Oh. I'm joking, Blake. I love you. Okay, what the fuck? I pressed that button on accident. That was one of the tapes in there. The bed- the bathrooms aren't here- or the, sorry, the bedrooms aren't here in Larry's world. Oh, they're- they are. Wait, I didn't even see. Oh. Maybe that put the tape there? Possibly. Yeah, we'll- we'll get there in a second. We'll just- we need to search these first. I did something. No. I don't know. Hmm. Okay. You went here with Larry? No, we haven't yet. We've gone in here as homeboy, but not as homeboy. Have we? I think we did, actually. Okay, let's see if that's what we need to do to open up the thingy. We move both characters anyways. What, sleepy time? What? Hold on, hold on. Is it is it a spoiler? If it's not a spoiler, then tell. Don't spoil things, please. Oh shit, my, my hand were on the wrong keys. Oh, it's getting longer. Oh, it's getting longer. Yep. It's getting more challenging. True, that's why there's blurry face paint everywhere. And that's why they're looking for the hooks too. Okay, can we go through oh this door is non existent. Sleepy time, you can sell stuff in your shipping box at your house. You don't need to go to Pierre's. Uh, when I first started playing Stardew Valley, I used to think the same thing, but you can literally ship stuff off at the shipping box at your house. There's a pentagram. You don't need to sell to Pierre. You you can sell it in the shipping box at your house, and then you'll get your money at the end of the night. After you go to sleep, you get all your money from everything you shipped off from that day. That's what I do every day. It's too much time to go all the way to Pierre to sell stuff. The shipping box, it's like right next to your house. It's like the, it's like the, the box like outside your house that you can put stuff in. Maybe Google it if you if you don't know what I'm talking about. The Google a picture of it. Anyway, wow, pentacle. We put that in there. Yeah. Oh wait, can we do something as sound now? Is it? Yeah, you get it at the start of the game. Oh, there's a tape here now. Well, let's see how weird this lady looks now. Rage. Okay, so we didn't miss one. Good. 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 We're almost done with them. Why do they torment us so? Slipping from our grasp, these filthy fucking pigs! They are swine at the <laughs> feet of God. Just so somebody doesn't call the police on us, just quiet down. <laughs> I'll 
corpses dragging their claws about and scurrying across the dirt, rearranging things, always rearranging. We will annihilate every molecule of their pitiful existence. Sickness. Sounds great. Okay, now that we now if we go back to yeah, sometimes you can sell stuff with that. You put all the all the stuff you want to sell in there, and then you get oh. your money at the end of the day after you go to sleep. But that's the that's how I love doing it. The pony the pony's gone in in the spirit realm. Gotcha. Okay. I'm not wrong, Sleepy Time. That's the best way to do it, because then at the end of the night, you get to see how much money you made in the day. I, I love shipping stuff off like that. It's very rewarding. And you can chop off everything. You can chip off your fish, and oh. literally anything you oh. want to sell. We help them. Wait. Yeah, anything you want to sell, just put in that ship off box. Any flowers, fish, uh... Before the light, there was darkness and nothing more. So we helped them, but not... But, but they're still high. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, maybe. I don't know, <laughs> maybe. maybe. But, I mean... Are we done with this floor, Sleepy Time? You got the tape you can dip? Alright, sick. Let's go. That's Let's life. Go. Wait, I wanna try something. Nope. Alright. Narp. We can dip now. Oh, you're trying to get the greenhouse? The greenhouse is really nice. I love it. I'm almost done with the community center. I only have one more. Stairs as Sal. All right. We're going down. I'm yelling timber. Hello, Mrs. Gibson. Oh, there's a rancid smell coming from the room. Maybe if we leave it like that, then we can do something as... Oh. Huh. Maybe there's something we get from this floor. I have a cat in Stardew Valley. My cat's name is Chester. Sister location. So stressful. Oh. We can't go down to the basement. There's no down. We can't go down. A young boy stands at the threshold of oblivion. Memorize. Oh. Whoa. Memorize by the eternal abyss. Tormented and bound to, by the world of mankind. Um. Terrence! Uh, um... How long have you been like this? Just slide away. Just slither away. Can you slide oh away? It's a cup of tea. A cup of tea? We can't switch back to him. Alright. 
Oh, wait, is this the blob from FNAF Security Breach? The cult do this to you. The child does not choose his own thing. It has always been this way. You must not understand the true harmony of the, the endless one. The true form of Terrence Addison. The true form of Terrence Addison. Whoa. What? Are you the endless one? What do you, why are you infecting the cells in this building? Wait, we missed the last tape? Oh, because we went through the thing uh, before. I didn't know Addison's door was going to make us do that. Right, I didn't know either. Darkness moves through all things and obeys our will. We are everlasting. We are beyond death. Terrence, we know you're in there somewhere. You have to stop this. You speak the name of a child. You speak the name of a child who is no more. Your struggle is meaningless. Then I will stop you m myself. You will try, and you will fail, as it always is. Just oh, oh shit! Oh. Boss battle, oh. baby! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh shit! Oh. It's a boss battle! Okay. I that and that. Yeah! I'm getting faster now because I'm memorizing them. Here we go, here we go. Oh shit! No! Oh, oh, okay, okay, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Uh this. This. No, I don't have any kids this, in Stardew yet. I just this, upgraded my house this. to have the nursery in it. Like I just upgraded my house. Okay. This this, 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 and this. Yes. yes. Uh, fuck this, 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 this. I'm so slow. This, 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 and okay. Ah. Okay. This. 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 Uh, this. 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 And the dot. And this. And this. Oh yeah, baby! Holy shit, I thought the dot was gonna be the last one. Why? Who are you? Terrence Addison. I've been wait. I've been waiting for you, Sal. I knew you would be the one. I knew from the moment I saw you, Terrence. My apologies, good sir. I haven't quite been myself, and I've caused so much pain. Is it over now? Almost. I'm afraid there is one more task remaining, and it is a hideous one. Whatever, whatever it is, I I will do it. Whatever it takes, end this for good. You must kill all those who have been tainted by the dark. Well, that's everyone in this building. Th those are me friends and family. You've cleared the darkness from their souls. We've already saved them. I'm afraid it's too late for them, Sal. Their souls are destroyed beyond repair. If left unchecked, the shadows will seep through the cracks and many more lives will be extinguished. My heart weighs heavy in sorrow for you. I know you will lose everything, just as I had many years ago. I don't know. I don't, I don't think I can do this. Please don't make me do this, Terrence. It is your choice to make. I know it's an extraordinary burden to bear, but I also know that you will do the right thing. I... Oh. So you have to kill everyone? Or does that know right, Sal? This must be done. I am so sorry. I wish there was another way. Oh my god. Wait. No. Sleepy Time is saying don't kill anyone. Don't kill Chug Lisa or Dota. Not Chug Lisa, no. Oh. This is horrible. 
Maybe we, Wait. Maybe we do deserve to go to jail. If we we're have to? Do. We have to kill her? Wait, can you go in that room or no? There's nothing else. Uh. You don't actually have a choice. Can you help me get into my apartment cell, please? Oh. Oh. Oh my god! Oh my god! Sally face, have you seen our little Tartar egg? We need to talk to him. Hey dude! Glad that you started to come back. Now we really can get this party started. Oh my god. I'm so sad. <laughs> no, David. <laughs> hey, you sounds. You just feel no right. I think there's something going around. You just didn't just see him walk in with a bloody knife. <laughs> Blake is just... <laughs> Yay, murder. No! Oh, uh. We have to kill the kid? Oh, this is so fucked. Wait. No. no. Wait, hold. Where's, where's the uh, emo girl, though? I know. Where is Evo bitch? Nope, a cola. So good. It's. Is that weed? I think that's. I don't know. <laughs> Sleepy time. Oh my oh god. god. What's up, my man? You're you're looking a little worse for wear. Everything okay? Oh my god, dude! I. Uh, I hate this game. I hate this. I hate this game. No! Hey, kiddo, there's some leftover lasagna in the fridge if you're hungry. You know, I may not say this enough, but I'm proud of you, Sal. You've come a long way, and I know it hasn't been, a been easy. I look at you now, and I'm excited about the man you're becoming. I think you've got a bright future ahead of you. I really do. I love you, buddy. There's what? no way this is real. This has to be something. What the heck? And the chat is just yeah, kill them all. It's standing on. I lag on the tree eyes and woke up in the temple. They had me tied down. There was something else there. I think it was the demon. They cut me and took some of my blood. There was a loud sound and I passed out again. When I came to, they were gone and I was untied. I don't feel right, Sal. I think I'm dying. Oh no. You know what? We deserve to go to jail. Ash was right. Wait. Oh, wait. Hold on. It was around 3 a.m. when I got the next phone call from Todd. He was crying so hard that I could barely make out what he was saying. I knew Todd and Sal were in trouble and that they were at the apartments. It sounded serious, so I called the police and rode over there right away. I got there just as the police showed up. On my way to the front door, I saw Todd running into the woods. I called out for him, but he just kept running. I approached the building and Sal was standing in the doorway, covered in blood, just staring out. He was mumbling the same thing over and over. I had no choice. I had to do it. There wasn't any other way. I tried to talk to him, but he was unresponsive. 
The cops pulled me away before I got any closer to him. Sal isn't an evil man. He's not a bad person. He just needs help. Oh my god. Dr. Enan, you've handled Mr. Fisher's psychiatric assessment during this time in prison, including several months of therapy sessions. This is correct? Yes, that is. this is correct. And what have you concluded from your time with the defendant? It is my professional opinion that Sal Fisher is perfectly sane and was 100% lucid while he proceeded the murder to the murder of the occupants of Addison Apartments. The elaborate story he concocted is simply a story. A tale to make him out to be the hero rather than the villain. He was so convinced that I began to believe his story. I went out to the apartments to visit the treehouse as Sal requested. There was nothing there at all. Wait! But he died though. This is the guy that got... that died, right? This is the therapist. Did the therapist die? But he's all green and shit. Huh. In fact, the further I poked into this story, the more inconsistencies there were. Oh yeah, didn't he fall out of the treehouse? Yeah, he fell out of the treehouse and died. Huh. These inconsistencies, along with all of the contradictory evidence, prove to me that Sal is not delusional, but simply lying to protect himself. In your opinion, is Sal Fisher a threat to the public? Absolutely. Without a doubt. This game is fucked up. Members of the jury, have you reached a verdict? Yes, Your Honor. We have reached a verdict. In the case of Sal Fisher versus the County of Knockville, what say you? She looks dead too. The members of this jury find the defendant guilty of first degree mass murder. I agree with the jury on the verdict of guilt and because of the severity of the crime committed, I hereby sentence Sal Fisher to receive capital punishment. Damn, so he's dead. No, you can't do that. He's sick. He needs our help. Order. Order in the court. <laughs> I hate right? mass murder. <laughs> this is so upsetting. But they're not... <laughs> what? Three years later, Ashley tried in almost every way she could think of to prevent Sal's execution and failed with each attempt. Now she sits in her living room as the new reveals... Uh, news reveals that today is the day Sal will be executed. A deep sadness washes over her. It's then that an idea comes to Ash that could change everything, though she has to act fast. Larry, are you here? Please, dude. If you're here, then show yourself. We need to help Sal. He's in trouble. Brought some of your old music. If this doesn't work, then this is the last time I'm coming up here. Larry? Holy fucking shit. Hey, Ash. You guys were telling the truth this whole time. Well, yeah, duh. I knew it. Well, I had my doubts, obviously, but I really, really wanted to believe it. Just don't fall out of the treehouse, okay? Huh? Never mind. How are we gonna help us out? Oh, I have a plan. Just hold still for a sec. Shit, that's right. There's no way she can capture him on camera. Damn. You can't capture a ghost on camera. No. There's no way. Wait. Oh. Yes, I got it!
Damn, bro, what the fuck? This is fucked up. This is fucked up. Sleepy time, why did you make me play this? <laughs> Oh, I can move. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Die, bitch, die, you motherfucker. Go, go, go! No! We have to at least see his face before he dies. I'm afraid it's too late, honey. They're strapping him in now. Oh. Wait, he was telling the truth. I have proof, please. You have to wait. Just let me show you what I found. Hey! Wait! Dumb bitch. Wow. Time of death is 6.33 p.m. Sal, oh god, no. Oh. Achievement unlocked, suffer. Wow. Is this like the bad ending? <laughs> or is this the ending? Bruh. What the fuck, man? Loving wife to Herman Sanderson, 1951 to 1992. Oh, that's Miss Sanderson? Loving wife to Sandra Sanderson, 1945 to 1999. Robert Silva. Rotten Pieces, 1969 1999. Ray and Janice's shared grave. Even death couldn't keep these two apart. Some Morrisons. I don't know who those were. Oh, Chug. Son, husband, father, friend, 1977 to 1999. Man, he was only like 30 something, I guess. But Sal committed the, the murders. Yeah. So he really did kill those people. Yeah. But he really was, did kill those. But there was a reasoning to why he killed them. Yeah, but, but he still. Yeah. It's, it's not something. I guess even if. Even if there was something going on, law still says that that's like mass murder right. and they don't really care. Because they don't know enough about the spirit world. Right. Okay. Huh. Yeah. Hey Chug, miss you, dude. God damn, everybody's fucking dead. Yeah. I can't. Fuck, that's soda. Son of Lisa and Jim Johnson, 1976 to 1999. They never did find Larry's body. Mother of Larry Johnson, wife of Henry Fisher, 1956 to 1999. Lisa was always so nice to me. She treated me like family. Husband of Lisa Johnson Fisher. Husband, father to Sal Fisher, 1947-1999. I can't imagine how much this hurts Sal. Oh, the mask. Son of Henry and Diane Fisher, 1976-2004. I wish you were here, Sal. Visited in a few nights, things have gone worse. Thank you all for liking and subscribing. Hope you had a good day. Hope you're gonna have a good day. And goodbye. Subscribe, like, and all that.